Hey, it's Jack here from the Arts Music Show. We're with Taylor Guitars at NAMM, and they're gonna walk us through the brand new Grand Pacific series. We're super excited, let's check it out. Hey everyone, I'm Mark with Taylor Guitars, and I'm here to show you what's new for 2019, starting with this right here. This is our new Grand Pacific, and it's the newest original body shape we have at Taylor Guitars, designed by Andy Powers, our master builder, and built on our V-Class bracing. As you may recall, last year at this time, we talked about V-Class bracing, introduced it to the world, and what it brings to the table. It brings to the table more volume for our guitars, more sustain, better intonation, and greater consistency across every note on the entire fingerboard. The guitar was inspired by Andy Powers' love of bluegrass and country, roots music from the 60s and 70s, and he wanted to create a guitar that had those sounds to it. So again, coming back to the Grand Pacific, we call it anything that ends in the number seven. Uh, this happens to be a 517. It's available in three models, a 317, a 517, and a 717, and we'll go through each one of them and show you what they're all about. What I have here is our 317. Our 317 features a Sapelli back and sides with a Sitka spruce top, and it comes with no cutaway, no armrest, but it does come with our new case, which comes in a Western floral pattern that looks like tooled leather. It's super cool. The guitar I'm holding here is our 517 Builders Edition. It features mahogany back and sides with a torrified spruce top. On the Builders Edition for Andy, it was all about comfort of play and sound. There's many features on this guitar, and we'll go through each one, starting with our compound carved neck on the back of the guitar. Down by the head of the guitar, it starts with more of a V, and as your hand moves up, it goes more into a C shape, which is really comfortable as you progress up the fingerboard. It also has rolled fret edges, which means the sides of the frets are much softer. Again, as you progress up the fingerboard, really a smooth feel. On the heel joint, we've rounded this as well to give us a little bit more access to the upper register, because on our Grand Pacifics, we do not have cutaways or armrests because the guitar was designed with tone in mind, and we didn't want to take anything away from it. We get to the body of the guitar, all the edges are chamfered, which means they're rounded. It's really comfortable on your leg down here, but also for your arm coming over the top, we don't have that hard crease there. On the Builder's Editions, we have two tops available. We have a natural finish or the wild honey burst, which you see here. We also have done a curved wing bridge on the back to make a little bit smoother feel on your hand, which is really cool. And finally, we have our 717 Builder's Edition. This has all the same features as our 517, but it features Indian rosewood back and sides instead of mahogany, still a torrified spruce top, and you have your choice of top, whether natural or the wild honey burst. All of our Grand Pacifics can come with or without electronics, but again, no cutaways, no armrests. So to recap, our new Grand Pacific is anything that ends in the number seven. We have three models currently available, the 317 Sapelli Sitka, we have the 517 Builder's Edition, which is mahogany and a torrified spruce top, and our 717 Builders Edition, which is Indian Rosewood with a torrified spruce top. And these guitars are not only amazing to play, but they sound incredible. It's got a very warm season sound to it with a lot of clear low end power. Once you put one in your hands, you're gonna have a hard time putting it down. That was super cool. You can check out the Grand Pacifics online or in-store at theartsmusicstore.com.